Now that we've finished our first test of 327 feet, we're gonna start at a jump distance to the sweet spot at 300 feet with the scaffolding testing in New Mexico. This is the town. Bryce is gonna take his Pro 2 and uh, jump completely over from end to end. Wow. Yeah, so there's your landing. It's huge. It's like an old western town. They used it in a bunch of movies and we went up there and checked it out. And it's a perfect run in. And you're going downhill. So much more you're precise. Yeah. 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 That's yeah. what we were just saying. I think you'll have way more control of the speed. Yeah. Coming down. It's always just, the craziest when you walk up here and just like look. Especially now with the landing where it's just like a sheer wall. And looks further away. Yeah. And I do right? it to myself it's like all the, gap. the time. You're like, Are you well, sure we jumped this early? <laughs> no, it looks killer. You guys killed it. We chose to do scaffolding here because you know, the elements here, like we wanted to make it look more natural, more real, as well as the space. You know, we have to build up against buildings and stuff. So when we build the dirt, it takes up quite a bit more space. And then it looks like from the takeoff, you can only see like half the landing because the buildings. So it looks like super narrow, but it's all right. It's funny, I was telling him like I walk up there and I'm like, this gap is no bigger than what we've done, but it just looks because like how the, the dirt, I mean, everything's like square here. The dirt's not running into each other. Like it looks so much bigger. 